All right, y'all, welcome back. It's Albert LaBelle. The lock we're going to take a look at this time is this funny, really strange uh, bicycle lock. Uh, if you can't tell from the package already, it's one of them weird locks that, that go on the uh, bicycle frame, kind of like where the brakes go. And uh, you bolt it on there, to again, to the frame, and then the uh, lock actually goes through the wheel of the bicycle. So actually, I guess even if you snap it off, uh, the lock's still locked to the wheel, so you'd still have to get the lock open somehow. Now this one here, it's way on the cheap end, but you know, I was I was shopping on eBay and I seen this thing and I just had to try it out. So here it is. Uh, by the way, very pricey for this thing. I think you can do much better. It was $15.62 at the time of purchase. Uh, you can probably do much better for the same same price. But even funnier is some of this some of this garb on the back here. Uh, it says basically up here it just says um uh constructed under the following specifications but some of these specs are pretty funny uh new style and good apparent uh, appearance solid construction long durability the top part of the lock is decorated with brilliantly colored trademark that <laughs> brilliantly colored trademark isn't that just beautiful uh the two caps are fixed in place uh look at that him proved technique uh the rim of the base of plate lock makes the lock more durable and secure the painted parts have been phosphated before spraying thus fast adhesion of paint and brilliancy of color it's just funny how they word some of this stuff i find it funny all right so let's see what we got here we got us a really okay it's a little it's even cheaper than i thought it was uh yeah so here are the brackets for mounting it. And like I said, it just goes kind of like where the brakes go. If you know how bicycle brakes work. And then this goes through the rim of the bicycle. And here are the keys. Tell you what, nice bidding. Got to give it that. And how does it work? We insert the key. Whoa. Okay, that's spring loaded. Okay, yeah. Very spring loaded. So that part right there will go through the wheel of the bicycle, locking it. And here are some of the mounts, and probably right here also. Uh, I mean, you can see how it's constructed. Very thin steel. I can. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, and my first thing I'm looking at though is probably like a pair of vice grips on this dude right here, and just twist it or snap it off. I don't think it would take that much. And it is key retaining. You gotta lock it back up so it engages to so get the key back out. So yeah, uh, again, I think you can do better for uh, for the money. This must be the caps they're talking about. Probably just to keep these ends together. And they're just slid on there probably. Yeah, I don't know. So yeah, let's see what it takes to pick into it just for fun, huh? Let's just grab one of my customized tension tools here that ought to work we can just put some tension on it there we go and let me just grab a sparrow that's a pretty wide open keyway not too concerned with thin picks and let's see if we can't pop it boom boom There we go. Okay. That wasn't hard. Uh, so yeah, again, what did I say I paid for it? Way too much. 1562. I think you can do much better. Uh, now, on the flip side, uh, if you were to use something like this, at least it's already attached to the bike and you don't have to carry nothing extra. Uh, bottom line, would I use it? Absolutely not. Uh, no. That's a big fat no. So there it is. That is the uh horseshoe bicycle lock all right so that's it thank you all so much for watching you want to see more stuff like this or even better uh subscribe it really helps me out okay subscribe all the cool people are doing it if you want to be cool you gotta subscribe thank you